What's going on, Shady People? Shady Penguin here, back with another episode of our Pokemon Y Combo Lock. This episode number 15, and before we get started, if you can, please show some shady love to that like button right below this video. Seriously, your support on this series means everything. You guys just saw all that grinding. I said in the last episode I would get up to level 25, 24. That was not happening. That was like 25 minutes of grinding you just saw, and I do not have the time nor the luxury to grind for two or three hours right now to get everyone up to level 24. So, this is our current team. However, good things did happen during that grinding montage. Blizzus evolved into an Azumarill. Lola evolved into a Diggersby. Uh, Honage gained a few levels, and this is where we're gonna sit. I turned battle animations back on, I turned the experience share off, and here we go. Here we go. Also, you guys saw in Connecting Cave, we pushed the stones in their appropriate places, and the biggest reason why I could not do that grinding was because the Pokemon were so weak. They were so weak, and I gotta lower this really quick. There we go. They were so weak, and I did not want to progress and go up here to our new route, Route 10. Where we're going to get an encounter right now. That was the other reason. I'm going to get a new Pokemon. Am I going to have to grind that one up too? I'm going to do another grinding session. So I decided to spend the 25 minutes. They turned into two minutes for you guys, thankfully. And if you watched it, you did. If you didn't, you did. But I'm going to go ahead and roll a die. We're going to see. Remember, one, two, or three is our encounter for the area. Four, five is a wonder trade. And six is an all-star. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's let it roll around a little bit. Let's let it be loud. And let's see what we got. Our number is going to be... It's a three! So our third encounter on this route is going to be the encounter that we need to use for our capture. So the first one, it doesn't matter. And I'm interested to see what level these Pokemon are. Sigaglyph, that would be a really cool Pokemon to have on the team. Uh, Sigaglyph, level 21. All right, so uh, if we could have grinded over here, we could have spent that 25 minutes and actually got on level. So that's good to know. Something tells me we're going to be doing that. In the next episode. So knockoff doesn't do as much as I wanted to. But it is a 2 at KO. Sigaglyph does go for the side beam. I should be able to eat it up though. I am a Bleezus and I am hungry. So we're going to get another knockoff off right here. Kill this Sigaglyph because I want I want the experience at this point. I know that we're here. We're, we're now we're recording. We're in regular state of mind. But honestly, I'm going to need this experience. Because I was not able to come up here and grind. Uh, had I had I realized, I wasn't sure if there would be story when I came up here. Had I realized there was no story, I would have done it at the end of the last episode. But this is our second one. It's a Snubble, and we know that Snubble is part fairy. I believe uh, Snubble is part fairy. I, I don't think it's like, uh, I don't think it's, I don't think it's like, Gran I think Granbo of all of them have it. So we're going to go for a waterfall. This should kill, because it's stab, not resisted. Wow, but he flinches! Poor little Snubble getting the flinch off. We'll go for the Aqua Jet to finish him off. We might gain another level. The good thing, though, about, and you know, this is... Grinding is much worse for people that don't have traded Pokemon. Like, Blizzus gains extra experience because it's an all-star. So this third encounter is going to be our legitimate encounter. In fact, I'm going to use Thread Strength to celebrate. And I'm going to move this stone with Digger B's Lola's giant ears. And just move this where we need to move it. Boom! And let's see, our third encounter is... It is a Golette! Another ghost type! Oh my goodness. Well, that'll be good to have on hand in case, uh... Our Aegislash goes down, but look at this. Um, I don't really have anything to hit it with that won't kill it. With please us. Uh, <laughs> um, shoot, I'm in a pickle. And I don't want to go out into Hungry and take a Ghost type attack. I gotta really hope that Aqua Jet doesn't kill. I gotta really hope that Aqua Jet doesn't kill. Please, 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 please. Yes! That's some bulk, Golette! Goes for the rollout, misses the rollout. Do we even want like, to capture this thing? It's missing rollouts already. Let's go for the Pokeball throw. Level 21. I think we should be able to capture this. Boom. That's one. Wait for it. Oh, wow, it actually popped out. You've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. Goes for the Mega Punch. Don't you dare kill, don't you dare kill. Alright, that didn't do a lot, that's good. We're gonna throw another ball at you. Maybe I should've bought Ultra Balls, or Great Balls, or better balls than Poke Balls. I don't know. One. No. Some tells me we're not gonna capture this thing. Goes for the rollout now. And this is gonna slowly gain extra damage. So we have to catch, capture this thing right now. Either that or we kill it. Uh, how about we give you a Luxury Ball? Do you want a Luxury Ball? Maybe you'll get inside of that. Look, it's cozy. It's fancy. I think you want it. One. Two. He wants it! Yes! Alright, so Golette gets in there. That means that I'm going to go ahead and go over to the latest episode of our combo lock and take a gander at the comment section. I'm logged into the Shady Side Gaming uh, right now. That's that's. I need to be into Shady Penguin. <clears throat> Ancient Science fashioned this Pokemon from clay. 
it's been active for thousands of years. So this is another Pokemon that's been created uh, from clay. That's interesting. I guess that's why it's a ghost type because it has that awkward ghost type. I don't really know. Uh, it's been infused with evil, perhaps. All right, let's go to the comment section and find someone to name this after. Let's see, let's see. Random comment, random comment, who answered question of the day? Um, let's see. Come on, I'm looking for question of the day. Question of the day with a good name. Okay, Zodiac Gaming answered, uh, said, my favorite hobby of mine is uh, playing Dota 2. He's trying to be get good enough to play for a tournament. Well, that means, I uh, good luck with that. I hope you can get good enough to play. Dota 2 is a very competitive game. Um, we're gonna name our Golet Zodiac, which I think is a really, really cool name for a Golurk. So Zodiac it is. Thank you so much, Zodiac Gaming, for your support, leaving comments, all that stuff. It really does change my life. So this is my way of saying, my small, 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 small way of saying thank you. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and we caught the Golurk. It's not, it's not in the party layout yet because I don't think I'm gonna keep it. Although it's level 21. Oh, I mean, it's another ground type. It's another ghost type. It's got a negative attack nature. That kind of stinks. Um, it has Iron Fist, though, and Shadow Punch. I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw it in the party. It's in a Luxury Ball. Let's keep it for now. We don't have anything else we want to replace it with regardless, so let's go ahead and keep it in the party for now. I do want to continue exploring up here because I know there's a little puzzle for me to solve to get this. Ooh, we also got uh, HM last time. Uh, TM, rather. We got Aerial Ace in, in Connecting Cave. So I think, oh, I didn't want to move that down. I think I just made a mistake. Hold on, I think I can fix it, though. It is fixable. Let's do this. One, two, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Hold on, hold on, push it up, push it up. Okay, all right, 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 right. Okay, go like this. Yep, okay, sweet, yeah, right, okay. Push the block up, yeah. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, I think we did it. Oh my goodness! This better be a good TM, because I'm getting awfully excited. <laughs> we did it, and we snagged ourselves Thunder Wave. So that's actually a pretty useful TM. That's pretty useful. That's definitely a good competitive TM. So let's go ahead. I think we want to run back and heal. Do we? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Any items over here? I'm guessing it's up there. Well, I guess we're battling. This place is flowing with power. I often come here to recharge. So in this episode, we did get a capture. Like I said, I like to have at least one thing happen in each episode. So now we're just going to hang out, clear this route out, gain some experience. And of course, in the beginning of the next episode, I will take care of some grinding to get everyone up to around level 24. Seeing as the wild Pokemon, let's see, look, this trainer has level 22. I'm hoping Knockoff is a one-hit KO. He's going to use Snatch? Was that what that was? Nope, he's waiting for me to move. Yeah, he wants to Snatch something. Knockoff is going to be a one-hit KO, so Solosis is just going to drop like the jelly that it is. And I'm going to gain boost the experience and grow to level 20. So that's nice. That's nice. You guys can let me know in the comment section below because I will not be recording this until after this goes up. I probably won't be recording this until Saturday. Uh, the next episode, I should say. Let me know what level you, I should train up to. And don't just say, don't grind at all. But, like, should it just be level 23? Should it be 24? You let me know. Most people are there. We might actually not have to grind. No, I'm looking at it. I don't know. But either way, let me leave that leave me that comment. Let me hop back, up, back on my bike because this dowsing machine is not worth it. I do want to heal up. So let's find that center of Pokemon. Uh, this music is powerful. I really enjoy this music thoroughly. Let me make sure the music's recording, actually, because we haven't had a problem like that in quite some time. Let's heal up! Hello and welcome to the Pokemon Center! Would you like to heal up Pokemon? Yes, okay, I'll take about it for a few seconds. Thank you! Thank you, thank you very much! Okay. My dad should be home by now. I don't know where he is. I'm not sure what's going on. So, I ordered card sleeves because I want to sleeve my whole collection of Pokemon cards. Uh, and as far as, like, one card from each, each set. So I want to do that. I have them in binders and stuff, but I want to sleeve them first. I thought I ordered 240 sleeves. I mean, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I thought I ordered, like, a th uh, uh, 800 sleeves. It turns out I ordered 2,400. So I have sleeves for days. They're just stones, right? I have sleeves for days. Like, I got 24 of these 100 packs Ultra Pro Deck Protectors. And uh, I'm glad because the Dragon Ball Z card game is coming out, and this actually fits those as well. So I'm not complaining, really. I just wanted to share the story with you. Uh, we do not have type advantage here, but I'm going to stay in and go for the knockoff. As my opponent goes for the stun spore, I really hate being paralyzed. I really gosh diggity darn do. But the knockoff we're going to see, it's going to be just about a one hit KO. I think an Aqua Jet, even though it's resisted, will take the Skip Bloom out because Skip Bloom is just a sad excuse for a Pokemon. Sorry, bro. 
You're just gonna have to go. Bars! Hashtag bars. Gaining the experience, growing to level 21, Belizeus is not slowing down. Belizeus wants to learn Aqua Tail. No, you fool of a took. Why would you want to learn that? Talk to me when you want to learn Play Rough. You want to send out Dunst Bars? You know what? Then I'm going to send out... You know what? Let's send out, send out uh, Lola. Because Lola is our second lowest level right now. I can't... I can't, I got... I'm going to have to... Aegislash is going to have to sit. I'm sorry, not Aegislash. Uh, Hone Edge is just going to have to sit for a little while until I get the time. And, uh, or get further enough ahead where it's worth it for me to send in, send out, send in, send out. But for now, Lola... Lola should do a decent amount. I mean, I'm a Diggers bee. I mean, I don't got, if I had huge power, that would be dead. And another yawner. Another yawner. I don't understand why. Why would you want to do this to me, man? Why would you want to put... You know what? We're going out to Belizeus. That way, in case you yawn again, it ain't gonna happen because I'm already paralyzed. Joke's on you! Joke's on you. Goes for the ancient power. Dunsparce needs to Mega Evolve already. What the heck? Can they just Mega Evolve Dunsparce already? He really deserves it. Aqua Jet should be able to kill from that range. It's a Dunsparce. I'm a Bleezus. It doesn't kill, though. I avoid the Screech, which is exciting, and I get fully powered on the next turn. Bleezus, you're putting my heart, heart in the air, and then you're dropping it, and then you're catching it again. Right now, you just catch it right before it hits the ground. But I don't like that scare. I don't like that scare. Don't do that to me. Don't do it. Please don't do it. Lola grows to level 21. 21. 21. Hey, yo, what's 9 plus 10? 21. Uh, let's go ahead. I think our best bet right now is to actually go out into Hungary. Because everyone else is weak to Azumarill. Except for Azumarill, but Azumarill can't do much to Azumarill, so... Everyone else is weak. I was really surprised at how early Diggersby and Azumarill evolved. I really had no idea, and I think Azumarill evolves based on happiness, so I guess my Meryl was just thrilled to be with me. But I'm not entirely sure. We can go for the stab side shock is our best bet as my opponent goes for a bubble beam, which isn't gonna do diddly bupkis. No diddly bupkis here, no diddly bupkis here, no diddly bupkis here. Side shock is wow, it's gonna be a three hit KO. That's unfortunate. I was hoping it would be a two hit KO, but it's gonna be uh tres. What is two plus three? Twenty man? Yes. The answer to any math question you may have. Twenty man. Let's go ahead and the last side shock to finish off this little trainer battle of Diggity Doodah. Diggity Doodah. We're gonna get to the stones and the stones, ho. Oh, the stones have a lore that you need more of in your life. It's a crit! Not that it matters, it was at the end. By the way, it's Crit Church still on sale for the next few days. It won't be back again until December, at which point it will be in a store for a higher price. But if you wanna pick it up, go for it. A link is in the description as always. Definitely just stones, don't you think? Huh? Don't you think? Shut up. All right, let's avoid you. Let's. I don't like the way you smell. So, I'm sure the dazzling machine would be good to use in here, but I'm gonna. Oh, 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 oh. We found an X accuracy. By the way, common question of the day. You guys see it? It's creative. What exactly is a monkey's uncle? Have fun with that. I have no idea what kind of responses to expect. Uh oh. Stop right there! I remember you! You're the one who foiled our fossil finding plans! And now you're here, standing around these stones. Do you have any idea what they even are? Of course you don't! You know nothing about the legend of 3,000 years ago that says... Wait! What does it say? Oh, whatever! Who cares about all that? It's time for me to get some sweet revenge! With STYLE! Captain Kinyu style. I'm challenged by team- I wonder how long he'll stay like that if I don't hit the button. Yeah, your arm's gonna get tired, buddy. All right, I'll hit the button for you. You're lucky people are watching, right? I'd let you sit there all day. I'd let you sit there all day. Hound hour. Hound hour. Well, I have a Bleezus, and even though I'm paralyzed, I think an Aqua Jet will one-shot you. And pop goes the Hound hour balloon. Just a no chance, man. Bleezus is just gonna be, is just gonna lead the way. As Bleezus should. Bleezus clears a path for all of us to follow. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go out into... I'm gonna go out into Lola. I know it's... I'm gonna be a little... I'm gonna be a little risque. I could go out into the Hungry and easily have type advantage and go for it, but let's let Lola get a little time to shine. She has ear hands. She has four hands! You know how many punches she can throw? We're gonna see how much a strength does to a Golbat. I didn't realize it was a Golbat. Uh, I thought it was a Zubat. But it is a Golbat. We are getting to the point of the game. We only have two badges, but... The grunts are starting to get a little harder. Uh, goes for the Confuse Ray. If you're confused, I'm not giving you any carrot soup later. You're not getting any. 
There's not any. Are you hope you hope you enjoy no care too. You know what? I tried, Lola. I tried for you. I really did. But Hungry's gonna have to come through and finish up what you couldn't. I hope you're proud of yourself, Lola. She's going right in her cage right after this battle. Right in her cage. Okay, we're switching right back out. We're switching. Oh, wait, no matter. That doesn't do too much. Okay, good. And you get hurt by the Rocky Helmet. Ho, ho, ho. All right, we can go for the side shock and fill, finish off. No, no, no. All right, Hungry. You're better than Lola, Hungry. You're better than Lola. You can do this. Just focus. You got this. I believe in you. Yes! David is better than Lola. David loves Lola. Hashtag David and Lola love. Right down in the comment section below. Go for it. I'm going to see how many of you guys do it. I'm going to control F and see how many of you guys actually care about my heart. So, Hungry Girls to level 25, taking the place of the Rest in Peace Nappy, who uh, died in our last episode, unfortunately. And he doesn't know that he died yet, uh, because he, he's away. And plus, I'm recording this right after, uh, the other episode isn't even uploaded yet. It's rendering right now, if you were wondering. What the? How could I lose again to a little punk like you? What are you, some kind of trainer prodigy or something? Holocaster. I see. Roger that! Gotta love the Holocaster. I can get updates on my mission in real time with this stylish device. Whoever thought this thing up must have been one truly stylish individual, too. And on that note, it's time for me to scram. With style! Alright, so he, he runs away with his tail between his legs. Uh, my Azumarill is paralyzed. I think I got a power heal, though. But I'm gonna go ahead and swap the Azumarill with Lola. Let Lo Actually, you know what? Yeah, let's let Lola. I want Dranzer to evolve, but I know I need a dark type in the party, which I don't have any of yet. So I might actually... Uh, at some point trade it over to my other game and evolve it and bring it back you guys Let me know what level would be good. Well, whatever level it normally evolves. I'll check it I'll check it on Cerebi and I'll probably do that just because I don't think you guys want to see me as a the, the small guy I think you guys want the big big guy the big one you guys like the big one, right? All right, so lowly you're actually weak to metatype, but you're gonna stay in you're gonna go for a strength Just to see how much you can do Plus this metatype might go for a bite or something goes for hidden power it's super effective. So what are the chances that it has stab, hidden power, fighting? What are the chances? I don't know, but Lola is going to be able to take this thing out and just barrage it with its strength and ferocity. And he goes down and says goodbye. Lola, Curlia. If I had more HP, I'd let you stay in, Lola. I really, really would. But I'm going to go ahead and go out into Zodiac. We're going to let Zodiac hit the field. Zodiac just sounds so powerful. It sounds so powerful. My goodness. Zodiac. That's gonna be my name for my Golurks from now on. You're gonna trace my Iron Fist. Luckily, you probably don't have anything. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and go for the Shadow Punch. I know it's neutral, but it's Stab. I'm trying to teleport in the middle of the trainer battle. Oh, never mind. You don't have Fairy Typing yet, do you? <laughs> never mind. We defeated Psychic. I could I couldn't control my overflowing, flowing flow of flow power flow. Right. So let's go ahead and grab this item up here, which is the big reason I came up here. I think this is still Route 10. I believe it is. Uh, so we still don't have another encounter. Uh, but I would like to get to the next town. Oh, another Team Flare Grunt. I would like to get to the next town, and then I can clear this route out on my own uh, in between episodes and do the grinding montage thing that we've been doing. Uh, although, I mean, that takes a lot of time up for me. All right, so we don't have any way to heal you up. Do we have Orin Berries? We do. We have two left. And okay, we're going to give Lola our last two Orin Berries. And let's go ahead and fight this Team Flare Grunt. Can't you see we adults are busy? Don't interrupt our work, kid. So we got Team Flare over here who's busy doing who knows what, and she's just got her hand on her hip like she's hip, and her name's Skip. Bars. Electrite comes through as I have Lola, which if I had the EQ, this would be a wrap. This would be a chicken Caesar salad right here, right now. But unfortunately, it's not, so I got to go for the strength, and it will probably be a 2 KO. That electric would have gone down. Oh, okay, you're gonna howl it up. Go ahead, howl it up. Get your attack up. Go for the go for the half a swords dance. I'm proud of you, dude. Either way, you're gonna get bopped by this strength. I really wish I had the EQ. This would have been over decades ago. Electric does fall. How sad is that? And Lola grows to level 22! Lola, Lola. And T Flare Grunt is gonna send out Croagunk. Alright. This point we're gonna go out into the hungry. We're going to go into the Hungry just because I think my opponent has three Pokemon. I really hope so because I just want to kill this Krogunk, switch back out, and get my HP back. Because I don't know how much further the town is. So Krogunk level 21 
Plus, oh my gosh, Hungry, you are so strong. Uh, unfortunately, my opponent, this is my opponent's last Pokemon, but uh, Poison Sting, that is a very small, 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 small attack, and Psy Shock's gonna one shot you. Bye! You're bopped. You're destroyed. It's over. It's over, over. Gonna gain 405, and BAM! There we go. Well, if that's how you're gonna be, I'll just stop working. Harumph. So you don't have to work anymore. I just gave you the day off. You should be happy. You should be happy with that. Seriously. Don't be so ungrateful all the time. Another Team Flare Grunt? Do you want to heal my Pokemon for me? People in ancient times must have been incredible. Hmm. Maybe I should say that it was the Pokemon in ancient times that were incredible. Foreshadowing. Foreshadowing. Uh, we'll leave Lola out front. We'll leave Lola out front. 52 HP. I think we're good. Let's go ahead and fight another Team Flare Grunt. You inspect the stones. I inspect you! Okay. Team Flare Grunt. Oh, it's a girl inspecting me too. My shady lady's not going to be happy about that. You better stop inspecting me right now. Alright, so my opponent opens up with a Gulpin, which I'm sure is going to end up yawning us. She only has one Pokemon though. So we just got to bop this thing. We're going to go for a couple strengths. Hopefully, uh, it's a 2 KO. That way, even if the Gulpin does yawn me, it's not a 2 KO. Going to go for Amnesia. Why do such 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 in, insignificant, insignificant Pokemon try to set up? I don't understand. I don't get it. Poison gas. That's 100%. I'm poisoned. That's it. That's the better toxic, let me tell you. That's the better toxic. I'm all out of water, which means this episode is ending very soon. That's what it means. I know that might sadden some of you guys, but that's what it means. Down goes the gulpin. Lola gains experience. She falls to her butt. And this has been fun. That's not, that's not bars. Don't, 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 nope, 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 nope! Alright, are we almost at the town yet? No, I don't... To have a battle at a famous sightseeing spot, all this will make for a great memory. Shut up, you shut up right now. I didn't want to... Oh, and it's some old lady! It's a tourist Tomoko! With a drift loom! Whom my diggers be can't hit! Lola is at a loss right now. Gonna have to switch out. And go out into the Dranzer. Nope, Dranzer can't touch you either. We're gonna have to go out into the Paralyzed Bleezus! The Paralyzed Bleezus. I am still wearing my green shirt in honor of the, um... Mega Rayquaza that was announced. Gonna go for the Gust. Which doesn't do too much. And you're frail, so I'm assuming an Aqua Jet will kill. Uh, it might not, though, but I hope it will. It doesn't. That was kind of barred somewhere in there. Now, as long as I can get this next Aqua Jet off... There's no way that Drifloon is gonna piss me off. I can't rhyme off, off and off. That, that is not, that's not bars either. Hmm. That's not bars either. Pachirisu! Let's go out into Zodiac. Because you can't hit me with your stab. And that makes for a good time. We do have a huge grass weakness on our team. Like, holy but hup, bupkis. We got two ground type and a water type. Actually, you got two ground type and two water types. Jeez. Well, hopefully we don't reverse any grass Pokemon. We're going to go ahead and go for the Shadow Punch because it is Stab and Iron Fist. For a Taurus, she's going hard in the paint. And she sets up the sand. Well, I'm assuming Shadow Punch isn't going to do too much. Oh, that still does more than I thought it would. So you know what? I'm okay with it. I'm going to go for another one. I'm guessing Pachirisu literally has absolutely nothing to hit me with. I can take it. It's not stabbed. Yes. All right. And Shadow Punch never misses. That's another really... Uh, when, when I saw that Shadow Punch never missed, that's another reason why I decided, you know what, Zodiac, you could be on our team. Zodiac is a boss. Let's get it. Let's get it with Zodiac. Honestly, at this point, I might end up putting back the Hone, Hone Edge, the Hone Edge, uh, in order to make room for Zodiac, because I don't think there's going to be anything else I'm going to find. I mean, if I, I'm basically saying is if I find something else, I'd sooner replace uh, Onens than Zodiac, because Zodiac is an awesome name. It's a crit! Give it us crits, it has Shadow Punch and Iron Fist, even with the negative attack nature, I'm still pretty happy with it. Plus, it's adorable in this stage, and it gets even more boss-like in its next stage. There are only two ghost types on our team, and I don't know. I guess typing-wise, the other one, uh, Onens would be better. But, wow, that did nothing. Um, Onens would be better typing-wise. I'm gonna have to switch out. But... I can't afford all that. Gr it's just the grinding. It's just the grinding for the Honage. But if if I if I get to a point where I lose Zodiac, I will I will focus on 
Oh my gosh, diggity dirt. Now we, see that was a good play. You went for the uh, indoor, we switched out. Aqua Jet, you can't indoor before Aqua Jet. Priority, baby. Done. Done. Unless indoor, indoor is a uh, priority, which it might be. I don't know. I'm not entirely sure. Don't quote me on anything. Never quote me on anything. All right, so we have to end this episode pretty soon. We're getting to the limit of time where I like to end episodes. Plus, we have the two-minute grinding. This is almost a 30-minute episode. And I don't want you guys to get used to that. I know what happened last episode, too, but we made it to the town. Geosenge Town. So we're going to walk right into the Pokemon Center. And we're going to heal up. We're going to end this episode right now. In the next episode, I'm going to go ahead and grind out that route. And then we'll continue going around Geosense Town and see what we got to see. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, rating, comment, and subscribe. Seriously, your support on this channel keeps me uh, going, able to do this, both in spirit and actually living and stuff. So that's fun. Have yourselves a good day. But above all else, keep it shady.